We're gonna do a grocery haul, show you what I got, and kind of go from there. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I thought I'd give you an insight to what my staple pieces are for meals. Um, I'm not on a cut. I'm not I'm just kind of maintaining, kind of staying the same. So my first item I get, um, I'm not a vegetarian. I'm not vegan. I do eat a lot of plant-based. I eat more fish than I do meat. The only meat I do eat is, on a regular, is ground turkey, lean ground turkey. I will make this up, as you've seen before. I put seasoning on and stuff. This is the only thing I can go to. Since my surgery, I find that I get kind of an upset stomach. Last night I had chicken wings, and then I remember why I don't eat chicken. So this is one thing I still do. I'm kind of weaning off of it, just trying to see the more research I do, the more I get scared, but it's all in preference, what works for you. Everyone has something different. So that's one of those wild fish, usually white fish. I go between tipula and haddock. I have three packs of these in the freezer. It's just easy. It's already single portion, so I can just grab one out and go. It just makes it easier for me fresh, I don't have the time to freeze it all up and put it away, so always look for wild. Important when you're looking for your fish is that it's wild. A new favorite find is these little things, and I got three different ones. I tried the salted caramel one, strawberry and cream, and I had the salted caramel. They were in the organic section, stuff I cook with. Avocado oil when I'm using frying anything and a spray form of coconut oil. I like this because the time you melt and it sits and I do use the other coconut oil as well but this is just easier when I want to bake some stuff and put some seasoning on. I just spray it up with this and it's so much easier. The find at Costco was the B or PB2 peanut butter powder peanut butter. Uh, a lot of people have been saying it's less calories, lots of less stuff in it, and um, it, I'm gonna give it a try. Stable girl for this stuff, so use it for sauces and stuff. I'm gonna see how it works out, um, but yeah, it was on for $6.99. Fruits, bananas, frozen pineapple, because fruit right now is ridiculously expensive, so right now we are like frozen. And then I cut these up and wash them as soon as I get them and take them out of the packaging. It is blackberries and strawberries. A few days a week with my eggs, I got the Ezekiel English muffins, so I can dip them in. I like to dip them in my yolk. Another source of protein, egg whites. I buy the Kirtland four, because I go through egg whites like there's no tomorrow. And we get eggs, fresh farm eggs. Um, Trevor works with a guy that has eggs, or eggs, has chickens, and we get the eggs from them. And avocados. And curb wise, besides the Zico, I go through sweet potatoes, so at Costco I get the big ones, and then I just chop them up into pieces. 
Baby potatoes, I've been, this has been a go-to. I put them in tin foil, put them in the oven, and I put some seasoning on them, and I have these for breakfast uh, with my eggs. On some days, for carbs, I love potatoes, and I have them earlier in the day, but don't be afraid of potatoes. And bell peppers, they pack sick, go through those. I buy a lot of my vegetables, and meat at Costco in big quantities because a lot of people think, oh, they're gonna go to waste. I go through so much of these that by next Saturday, I have to go buy more because I'm out. I love my veggies. I have been getting Brussels sprouts, but the last two times I've gone last Saturday and this Saturday, they have had none. So I usually get asparagus with it anyways, but I, I've been going to Brussels sprouts, but when they don't happen, you go with what you can get. So I got a big bag of asparagus because I go through this. And broccoli. And baby spinach, big thing. This is good for, I've been having salad cravings too, so I've been having a lot of salads and Instead of dressing, I put salsa on top of it, and uh, it's really good. Tomatoes. It's more fruit, but you know, I consider it a vegetable even though it's a fruit. Oh, and this is a new find. I've been seeing people on YouTube uh, talking about the silk coconut um, yogurt. So it's unsweetened uh, vanilla, but I wanted to try it because I used to love Greek yogurt, but then my sensitivity to my stomach, the dairy didn't like me, so I've cut out most dairy. Once in a while, I'll have cut of cheese, but I don't drink milk. I don't, it just, my stomach doesn't like it thing. Same company. Coconut for coffee, so this is the creamer I use. It's, uh, again, my dairy, and this is the only, usually I have a black with a shot of vanilla in it, so. That's my grocery haul. That's my staple pieces that I get. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Real tough. Didn't make it to the gym yesterday. So, it's a new day. Feeling good. Feeling alive. Gonna hit this full body workout and we are gonna smash it, kill it, and maybe have a nap. No, I don't have time for a nap. It's another 15 hour work day. Been at work since 5.30. Hey.